Hi, my name is Graham Flanagan, and I've been an iPhone addict for the last 10 years. Switching to Android just never seemed like a real option. Android. But the more and more I hear and read about them, they seem like they might actually be superior to the iPhone. So this week, I am going to try out the Pixel 2. Unboxing. For the next few days, I'm gonna try and use the Google Pixel 2 for everything. Okay, so one week has passed. My initial impression is I love the phone. It's a phone that is just as good, if not better, than the iPhone. I could easily see myself switching to a Pixel phone. And with a price point of only $650, it would be very uh, economically sound to do that. So let's talk about a few of the aspects of the Pixel 2 that I really enjoyed. The advantage that stands out the most over the iPhone is the battery life. I never had a situation where I felt like the battery was about to die. And that happens all the time with the iPhone. And I gotta say, of course, there was a learning curve, a little bit of a learning curve switching over to Android. But by the end of the week, I feel really comfortable with it. It's noticeably lighter than the, the iPhone. I like that. Here's one area where I think the iPhone definitely wins. The dongle for the Pixel is huge. It's ridiculous. Look at those two put side by side. If you're gonna have a dongle, make it as small as possible. Apple definitely wins there. Just like with the new iPhones, there's no headphone jack, which is the worst technological advancement in recent memory. Hands down, the camera on the Pixel 2 is better than what you see with an iPhone. Here's some examples of photos that I took while on a farm in Virginia. Just look at that clarity. Look at the, the hair on that goat. This one was taken with an iPhone. Same goat. The image is not as high quality as the one taken with the Pixel. Get back. The Pixel's video quality, also outstanding. The colors just pop. Here's some footage I took of the New York City skyline from an airplane. As you can see, when you zoom in, the zoom on the video camera, like most smartphone cameras, isn't that great. You lose a lot of resolution. But generally, I was a big fan of the video, so that's just a definite advantage. Even though I've been like an iPhone disciple, for like 10 years. I feel like that's just been uh, because it's been a force of habit and not really because I felt like iPhones were the best phones. And now that I'm comfortable with the Android operating system, Android. I might be ready to make the 